In at number 10, Sharon Osbourne. Sharon Osbourne has been very open about her use of cosmetic procedures over the years. She even revealed in a 2013 memoir that she was done with surgery altogether, but that went out the window in 2019 when she revealed that she got another facelift, making it her fourth ever. Sharon is no stranger to cosmetic procedures. In 1999, she lost over 100 pounds after she underwent gastric bypass surgery. She also spent $120,000 on a facelift, tummy tuck, eye lift, abdominoplasty, liposuction, and Botox as well. In 2007, Sharon admitted that at that time, she had spent roughly $530,000 on cosmetic procedures in total. She's openly said in the past, quote, there's not much I haven't tweaked, stretched, peeled, lasered, veneered, enhanced, or removed altogether. And of course, all her procedures have changed her appearance drastically. And at number 9, Julie Chen. Julie Chen is known as the host of the hit show Big Brother. She revealed to the talk in 2013 that in the start of her career, she decided to have eye surgery that would make her eyes appear larger. Apparently, when she was starting out, she wasn't able to get an agent because they said her Asian eyes did not look good on TV. This pushed her to get an eyelid surgery, which she does not regret. When speaking about the procedure, she said, quote, No one's more proud of being Chinese than I am. Every decision I've made, it got me to where I am today, and I'm not going to look back. And at number 8, Kylie Jenner. Anyone with eyes can see that Kylie Jenner has had a dramatic change in her appearance over the last few years, and it seems that she has underwent cosmetic procedures in an attempt to look more like her sister Kim. In 2016, after months of denying, she finally revealed that she received lip fillers. She even revealed to Alert that at one point she regretted her full lips. She told her sister Kim, quote, well, I definitely made my lips a little too big at one point, adding, thank God I didn't end up on botched. Kylie has not admitted to any other procedures, but it's widely speculated that she's gotten filler in her cheeks and chin, along with a Brazilian butt lift and breast implants. And at number 7, Tidy Montag. The reality star went from girl next door to Hollywood Barbie after she got a number of plastic surgery procedures that made her unrecognizable. She even risked her life to have 10 procedures in one single day. Just some of the procedures that she underwent were a brow lift, a nose job, lipo on her stomach and thighs, and a butt augmentation. But after all her surgeries, she revealed that she regrets the decision, and she ended up having health problems because of all the stress to her body. She told Us Weekly in 2013, quote, I just didn't realize what I was really signing up for. It just sounds so minor when you have a surgeon describing so much of it to you, like, okay, great, a little of this, a little of that. You're not told the recovery time and the mental strain it will put on you in the long term. And at number six, Katie Price. British model Katie Price has been open about her many plastic surgery procedures that have changed her face considerably over the years. But she recently revealed that she regrets a lot of it, and at one point she felt like a monster. Katie has told media outlets that she received a full body liposuction, liposuction under her chin, and fat injected into her bum. Apparently after one round of procedures, she was told she needed a blood transfusion, but she was too scared of getting COVID to get one. At one point she was regretting it all, asking herself, what the F have I done? Honestly, I've gone to hell and back, it was horrific. Oh my god, I look like a monster out of a horror movie. She also revealed that she lost count of how many boob jobs that she's had over the years, saying it's around 12. Katie said she was all natural until she turned 30. Now she has almost everything done. Halfway at number 5, Nikki Cox. Actress Nikki Cox was one of the hottest stars in TV in the late 1990s and early 2000s, but her career faded after some botched cosmetic procedures. The biggest difference seems to be her large lips and tight face. Some paparazzi photos of her were leaked in 2013, showing her looking much different than the woman that we had seen on screen, and many outlets called her botched and unrecognizable. One plastic surgeon gave his opinion on her look. He speculated that she didn't go under the knife, but claimed her shocking look is due to botched filler. And at number 4, Donatella Versace. Donatella got her fame through running high-end fashion brand Versace with her late brother Gianni. And in the decades since she's been a public figure, her face has changed considerably. Most would say for the worse. Over time, she's become unrecognizable with her nose and lips changing the most. It's gotten so bad that Donatella has landed herself on pretty much every worst plastic surgery list that there is. Donatella has only admitted to getting Botox, nothing more, so she hasn't admitted to regretting any of her procedures. When asked about her different look, she said, quote, I'm not like this genetically. I use tons of cream and take care of my hair and skin. And at number three, Ronnie Ortiz Magro. Back in the day, the men of Jersey Shore were known for their chiseled abs and tan skin. But as time has gone on, 
the men have not been able to keep up with their strict diet and workout regimen, and they've lost the six packs that they were known for. In 2019, Ronnie revealed he underwent liposuction to enhance his six pack after welcoming his daughter Ariana the year before. While he was on the show called The Doctors, he said, quote, A year ago to the day, my life completely changed. I had a little baby girl, she's like my guardian angel, and now I can't spend two or three hours in the gym every day like I used to. The procedure was a laser high definition liposuction of the abdomen, which defined the area around his six pack. And at number two, Dolores Catania. The Real Housewives of New Jersey star went through multiple plastic surgeries since she became a star. She admitted to getting tummy tuck surgery, breast augmentation, facelift, liposuction, and a Brazilian butt lift. She revealed it actually put a strain on her relationship because her boyfriend did not support it at first. On the Getting Real with the Housewives podcast, she said, quote, He was really angry. He was so mad at me and he didn't let up on it. I let him be mad for a little while and then I had to say, listen, you either live with it or we just have to move on. And finally at number one, Larissa Dos Santos Lima. The 90 Day Fiance star revealed an entirely new look in September of 2020 after she allegedly spent $72,000 on cosmetic enhancements. These procedures included a nose job, liposuction, and breast and butt augmentation. She spoke about the procedures on an episode of 90 Day Fiance Happily Ever After where she said, quote, I lose weight, I did butt to make it bigger, I did Botox, I did my nose, I did my lips, I did my cheekbones, I did my chin. I am a new woman and I feel very happy. With all the cosmetic enhancements, she looks unrecognizable from how she looked before the show. And at number 10, Paul Stanley. The KISS frontman looks very different now than when the band was in its height, and people think the change is due to cosmetic procedures. It's rumored that he had a nose job, facelift, along with other fillers and Botox. Some evidence also suggests he may have underwent an eyebrow lift and a lip job. Stanley is only admitted to one procedure, and that was an ear reconstructive surgery. He got this because he was born with the condition, microtia, which caused him to not have a right ear. While speaking with SiriusXM's Jim and Sam video interviews, Stanley also admitted to having his rotator cuffs repaired, along with the hip replacement and cartilage repaired in his knees, but nothing related to his appearance. And at number 9, Michaela Romanini. For many years, she was one of Italy's biggest stars and was titled one of the most beautiful women in the country. But after getting many cosmetic procedures, she was left looking completely unrecognizable from her former self. We're not sure exactly what procedures that she's gotten, but but it's clear her lips, eyes, and skin look drastically different. Some media outlets even say she looks like an alien. But even with all the criticism around her looks, she apparently does not regret any of her procedures. Some reports even claim she is now addicted to surgery, specifically lip collagen injections. And at number 8, Kenny Rogers. The late Kenny Rogers decided to undergo cosmetic surgery, and it changed his appearance so drastically that it really hurt his confidence. He told CBS host Gail King in 2012, quote, I was trying to hide myself. I had the money to do it, and I had time off. It was one of those things that I think everybody's like, you look at yourself and you go, could I be better if I did this or I did that? Adding that he regrets doing anything, and he's always very curious as to what he would have looked like without it. He also said that the changes in his appearance did not affect his music or singing voice, but rather his confidence to get on stage and make music. He even cancelled some shows during his 2018 farewell tour because he was battling health challenges, which some speculated was due to the surgeries. His worst procedure was a botched eyelid lift. He said about the procedure in 2006, quote, I'm not happy about it. It drives me crazy. And at number 7, Joan Rivers. The late Joan Rivers is a comedy legend, and she's been very open about the countless cosmetic procedures she underwent through the years. Just some of the procedures that she's admitted to include a facelift, neck lift, and eyelid surgery. However, she passed away at the age of 81 due to complications with a cosmetic procedure. Her daughter Melissa spoke about the tragedy in a memoir that she wrote about her mother called The Book of Joan, Tales of Mirth, Mischief, and Manipulation. In the book, Melissa states that Joan received 348 cosmetic procedures over her lifetime because she was always insecure about her looks. Melissa also appeared on the Today Show and spoke about her mother's tragic death following complications during a throat surgery saying, quote, In my opinion, it was 100% preventable. Melissa actually filed a lawsuit against the clinic, saying they were not prepared and very unprofessional. And at number 6, Priscilla Presley. Priscilla Presley has no signs of aging on her face, even though she is 76 years old. But she does look completely unrecognizable from her former self. Some say this is due to botched procedures over the years. A few years back, she revealed that low-grade silicone was injected into her face, the type that mechanics use to grease car parts. This was done by fraudulent doctor, Dr. Daniel Serrano, who was later sent to prison for his illegal tactics. A rep for Priscilla said, quote, Priscilla Presley was one of many documented victims of Dr. Serrano. An investigation which uncovered his misconduct ultimately led to his imprisonment. Ms. Presley 
finally dealt with this matter years ago and everything is now well. However, one doctor does not think the botched injections explain her puffy, waxy face, and he insisted that this is due to repeated laser treatments and Botox. One commenter wrote about her look, quote, What has Priscilla Presley done to her face? It looks like she has a scary mask on. Halfway number 5, Jackie Stallone. The late mother of A-list actor Sylvester Stallone revealed that she had many plastic surgery regrets in a 2013 interview. When asked if she had had work done, she said, quote, I do and actually I've gotten too much. I look like I've got a mouthful of nuts. It's Juvederm, too much of it. I feel as though I look like a chipmunk. She continued, Juvederm plumps you up here, pointing at her cheeks, but it looks like you have a mouthful of walnuts. She then explained that she's had about three chemical peels and about 50 injections over her lifetime. She revealed that she had never tried Botox because naturally she did not have wrinkles in her forehead. Jackie claims that she believes in plastic surgery, but thinks that Beverly Hills doctors are overrated hacks, saying that she went to other states to have work done because she doesn't trust Beverly Hills surgery. And at number 4, Simon Cowell. Simon Cowell shocked fans when he appeared at the red carpet for the America's Got Talent quarterfinals, looking totally unrecognizable. His face was discussed at length in the media, and on the Absolute Radio Breakfast show, Dave Barry said, quote, I remember Simon Cowell when he had his first face. I've known him a long time. The current one is a bit slipknot. It's actually quite terrifying. With the host noting that his surgery was probably done in the dark if it came out that badly, and that a man with his money should have gotten the best surgeon in the world. After stepping out, Dr. Nyla Raja, a leading cosmetic doctor, said that he had gone a bit overboard with the Botox, adding, quote, adding, quote, I suspect Simon's fallen complexion is a combination of weight loss and also too much Botox. And at number three, Khloe Kardashian. Khloe Kardashian is the sister that gets the most slack for her cosmetic enhancements because it seems like she looks different every week. While speaking about rumors about her plastic surgery, she told host Andy Cohen that she's had one nose job, along with fillers, but not Botox. Years earlier on her talk show Cocktails with Chloe, she also admitted to having facial fillers dissolved, saying, quote, My face was so messed up I had to go and get this whole thing dissolved. It was a bummer and now I'm afraid to do it again, and I'm almost like, I swear things are still in my face. Although people don't believe she hasn't touched fillers, because her face has changed dramatically since then. And at number 2, Lisa Rinna. The Real Housewives of Beverly Hills star is known for her signature pout that she achieved through the help of fillers. But she's gotten some other procedures that she's regretted. Apparently after she tried Botox, she was totally botched. Lisa said that she got Botox in her cheeks because all of her friends were getting it done and she wanted to try it out for herself. But after the procedure was done, Lisa said, quote, I saw a photo and I was like, oh Jesus, that's not good, that is not good. But after that experience, she's learned that less is more, saying that she still likes Botox but won't do anything that changes the shape of her face. And finally, at number one, Dolly Parton. Dolly Parton is my queen and I love her so much, but it's clear to her fans that she's changed a lot over the years and she's been vocal that the changes are due to cosmetic enhancements. She told CBS Sunday Morning in 2019, quote, It's true that I look artificial, but I believe that I'm totally real. My look is really based on a country girl's idea of glam. I wasn't naturally pretty, so I make the most of anything I've got. Dolly's admitted to many procedures, including a facelift, eye surgery, breast implants, liposuction, excess skin removal, lip injections, Botox, and more. Dolly also looks phenomenal at her age of 75 and says that she will look as young as her plastic surgeons allow. In at number 10, Dory Kemsley. Dory Kemsley has starred on The Real Housewives of Beverly Hills since season 7, and her face has changed considerably since she's been in the spotlight. If you look even further back, Dorit looks unrecognizable from her younger self, leading many to believe she's had lots of cosmetic enhancements. Dorit addressed these rumors in a recent Instagram AMA. When asked if she'd ever had plastic surgery, she responded, quote, The only plastic surgery that I've had done is my boobs. It drives me crazy when people say I've had plastic surgery on my face. I've done filler and Botox and I work with masterful makeup artists who can transform your face. She has also addressed this topic in multiple reunions for the show. In last year's reunion, she said she thinks it's comical when people claim that she's had a facelift or a bunch of surgeries. She also revealed in this year's reunion that she's never had a nose job. But honestly, a lot of fans do not believe her. And at number 9, Courtney Cox. Courtney Cox was at the center of plastic surgery rumors when she all of a sudden looked unrecognizable from her former self. Courtney addressed the rumors and revealed that she did not have plastic surgery, but she did get fillers and Botox every now and then, which led to layers and layers of changes that she just didn't like. Cox told New Beauty, quote, I've had all my fillers dissolved. I'm as natural as I can be. I feel better because I look like myself. 
I think that I now look more like the person that I was. I hope I do. And then number eight, Janice Dickinson. Janice Dickinson has been deemed the world's first supermodel, starting her career very early, then transitioning into reality TV and publishing. But as she got older, her looks changed in ways that she didn't like, and she started to get procedures to stay younger. She admitted that she got her first cosmetic procedure at the age of 33. In an interview with ABC News, Janice revealed all her procedures. Quote, brow lift, yes, I've had my brow lifted. She said I was getting a bit of sag coming down my face, so I lifted them up. Yes, I've had collagen put in, injections. It's for the fine lines on the face. Because of all her cosmetic work, she looks unrecognizable from who we knew in her modeling days. And at number seven, Melanie Griffith. Melanie Griffith says she didn't realize how much she had changed from her cosmetic enhancements until she heard what fans were saying about her appearance. She said, quote, I didn't realize until people started saying, oh my god, what has she done? I was so hurt I went to a different doctor and he started dissolving all of the shit this other woman doctor had put in. Hopefully I look more normal now. Melanie also spoke about how her many divorces and substance abuse affected not only her life but her appearance as well. But following her split from Antonio Banderas, she says she's in a healthy place and is hanging out with her girlfriends. And at number 6, Tara Reid. Tara Reid underwent multiple plastic surgeries after she started a few hit movies, including American Pie and The Pussycat Dolls. In 2004, after many of the surgeries were botched, she was forced to undergo corrective surgeries in 2007. She told Us Weekly, quote, I had a hernia, this huge bump next to my belly button. As a result, I couldn't wear a bikini. I lost a lot of work. After the botched surgery, she was unable to land the same high caliber projects that she had once before, and she was only considered for spoof movies like Sharknado. She told People in 2008, quote, In my American Pie days, everyone was kissing my butt. I didn't realize how good I had it. Now she's terrified of ever getting surgery or cosmetic enhancements again. Halfway number five, Reed Ewig. While modern family actor Reed Ewig was suffering from body dysmorphia, he underwent several cosmetic procedures, all of which he regrets. He told the Huffington Post that after all the swelling from the surgeries went down, the results were not all what he expected. Adding, quote, I vowed I would never get cosmetic surgery again, even though I was still deeply insecure about my looks. It took me about six months before I was comfortable with people even looking at me. I wish I could go back and undo all the surgeries. While he was recovering, he decided to take some time away from acting. And at number four, Jennifer Grey. The legendary Dirty Dancing star was known for her unique nose that really made her stand out from the crowd. However, in 1989, after she became a huge star, she decided to get a nose job and made her nose look like every other big star. And sadly, her career shrank alongside her small nose. The nose job was pretty minor, but because her nose was so distinct before, it made her completely unrecognizable. She said about the regrettable procedure quote, I went into the operating room a celebrity and came out anonymous. And because nobody recognized her, she didn't have the star power the movies were looking for and she stopped landing roles as a result. And at number 3, Rumor Willis. After Rumor stepped out looking very different from her usual self, fans speculated that she went under the knife. It was rumored that she received a nose job, reduced her chin, and had lip injections. It's not a stretch to assume that she's had work done, as rumors admitted she supports plastic surgery and would be open if she went that route. She said, quote, In Hollywood, I feel like there's a big stigma about hiding things, but people aren't stupid. If all of a sudden you jump from being an A cup to like double Ds, people know. I just think you have to be who you are and own it, and not be ashamed to feel like you have to apologize. Rumors also opened up about feeling pressure from social media to change her looks because people are more vocal behind a computer screen. In at number two, Bella Thorne. Bella Thorne was first known to the world as a Disney star on the show Shake It Up. But as she grew older, she changed more than what was possible naturally. Bella has been accused of having a nose job, boob job, and getting lip filler. It's speculated that she had her first lip injection when she was just 16 and had a rhinoplasty the following year. As for breast implants, one source claims she went from a 34A to a 34DD. Bella has not commented directly on these surgery accusations, but from the changes, it's assumed that she is not au naturel. And finally, number one, Charlotte Crosby. The Geordie Shore star has been getting surgery ever since she got on TV and has changed drastically. It's at the point where some fans are worried she actually has a surgery addiction. Charlotte openly admitted that she'd had a nose job back in 2016. She also admits to getting lip filler once a year and getting a boob job to correct a medical condition she was born with that gave her a quote uniboob. The first cosmetic enhancement she received was a tattoo on her eyebrow so she wouldn't need to fill them in. At first, Charlotte hid her rhinoplasty from fans, but weeks later, she posted a YouTube vlog about the entire process. After she posted photos from a holiday she took to Brazil, the comments accused her of getting more work done. One comment said, She should have stopped with the surgery, Botox, and fillers a long time ago. Another person wrote, Poor girl, her face is badly swollen. Is it an allergy? At number 10, Carrot Top. 
American comedian Carrot Top is pretty well known for his signature looks. With his bright orange hair and crazy expressions, no one can mistake him, that's for sure. However, over the years, there's been speculation that the comedian has undergone a few cosmetic surgeries that have him looking a little different. Some saying that he's actually been botched, but the overall consensus is that he looks pretty unrecognizable. Though he's denied ever having received plastic surgery and mostly credits his looks to his gym habits, there are others out there who think that there's something a little artificial that the comedian has been hiding from his fans because though his body is different from working out, his face has been altered as well. It is believed that the comedian has received an eyebrow lift, Botox injections, lip filler, and laser peels, which many people see as the reasons his freckles are less evident. Because of the fillers and lifts, a lot of people think his face has been left looking a little too stiff and a little too fake. In at number 9, Lara Flynn Boyle. Boyle was stunning in the 90s when she acted on shows like Twin Peaks and The Practice. But in the early 2000s, her look started changing drastically, specifically her lips. Over time, her face started to look very unnatural, and nobody wanted to cast her anymore. Boyle commented before her procedures that she was scared of aging, as she knew she would lose work. But her botched procedures are what have actually blacklisted her from the industry. In 2010, Paul S. Nassif told the Daily Mail, quote, Lara Flynn Boyle appears to have had a rhinoplasty, lip augmentation, Botox, facial fillers, and possibly a brow lift and facelift. Also saying she should refrain from any more procedures. Another plastic surgeon agreed, telling the outlet that she had gone overboard with the fillers for her cheeks and lips. At number 8, Jocelyn Wildenstein. When you look up the most drastic celebrity appearances, a photo of Jocelyn Wildenstein will no doubt appear in your search. Her looks are a prime example of someone taking plastic surgery too far and looking nothing like they did before. Though she was a model back in the day, too much plastic surgery has altered her appearance forever, to the point where she's mostly plastic, mostly botched, and looks like a completely different person. Jocelyn apparently started changing her appearance to make her husband happy, and she even modeled her look after big cats because her late husband was a big cat lover. She reportedly kept a lynx as a pet and she said that she thought that the big cat's eyes were so perfect she wanted to look just like it. Unfortunately, she went too far with her look. Over the years, she's gotten surgery on her eyes to make them look more cat-like, as well as receiving brow and facelifts, injections, implants, and more. She's loved looking nothing like how she did before all the surgery, with her entire face being remade into something completely new and unnatural. Even though her appearance is quite drastic, Jocelyn has said that she's not done altering her looks. And at number 7, Courtney Love. Courtney Love has admitted to having three major procedures to change her looks. But unfortunately, she hasn't been happy with any of them. The first procedure was a liposuction on her butt. She claimed that it actually ruined her figure, and she discouraged anyone else from getting it done. She also had a mouth enhancement, which she wasn't happy with either. She said after the procedure, quote, I just want the mouth that God gave me back. It was perfectly cute, and I had nice big lips. The last procedure she has admitted to was a nose job, although after the original procedure, she ended up getting it corrected because she didn't like it, even calling it a, quote, little beak at one point. All this aside, Courtney looks very beautiful now, although it's clear she looks vastly different than her natural self. At number 6, Dana Delaney. Getting Botox is a pretty common thing these days. Getting injectables seems to be the newest trend, probably because it's one of the least invasive plastic surgery procedures that you can receive. But just because it's not considered a major procedure, that doesn't necessarily mean that there's no risk, and Desperate Housewives actress Dana Delaney can tell you all about it. Dana opened up about one of the worst procedures that she's received that completely changed her face. In 2003, Dana decided to go in and receive some Botox injections after her dermatologist convinced her to try it out, and when she went in for the procedure, things went horribly wrong when the doctor performing the procedure injected the needle into the wrong place in her forehead and actually caused quite a bit of damage. When he injected the syringe into her forehead, the needle ended up striking a nerve. This then created a huge hematoma, and it actually ended up killing the nerve that was struck. Unfortunately for Dana, this mistake was pretty serious because it ended up affecting the muscle in her right eye, which caused her eye to begin to droop down slightly. Dana spoke out about the experience saying, quote, I noticed it more than anybody else, but I was symmetrical before and now I'm not. End quote. This made her look pretty unrecognizable since it literally changed the symmetry of her face.
Halfway number 5, Bella Hadid. Bella Hadid was voted the most beautiful person in the world at one point, but it's hard to believe she's all natural. Bella never talks about the work she's had done, but from before and after pictures it's clear that she's had a lot of enhancements. During a 2018 interview she responded to comments about her plastic surgery, saying quote, People think I got all this surgery or did this or that, and you know what? We can do a scan of my face darling. I'm scared of putting fillers into my lips, I wouldn't want to mess up my face. But with the before and afters that we have, it's hard to to claim that it's all puberty. The most common surgeries that have been rumored are a nose job, cat eye, eyebrow lift, and either fillers or surgery to sharpen her face. At number 4, Priscilla Presley. This is by far the worst plastic surgery story out there because not only did Priscilla end up botched, but she also drastically changed her looks. Priscilla Presley, the wife of the late Elvis Presley, suffered through a plastic surgery nightmare when she went in to receive injectables from a very unreliable source. Priscilla had begun dabbling in plastic surgery, undergoing a few procedures such as injections and facelifts, but when she fell victim to an unlicensed cosmetic surgeon, that's when things got really, really bad. This unlicensed professional gave Priscilla injections in her cheeks and used products and techniques that were unapproved. To make matters worse, it turned out that the silicone that this so-called doctor used on Priscilla was not medical grade and was instead a substance similar to that which mechanics use for car parts. Thankfully, Priscilla got justice against this doctor and the individual who performed these procedures got jail time, but sadly Priscilla as well as a handful of other people were left as botched victims of this mad doctor and Priscilla's looks were never the same. In at number 3, LaToya Jackson. LaToya Jackson has had major plastic surgery over the years, it's to a point that her past self is completely unrecognizable. The most noticeable procedure LaToya has had is a nose job. It was reported in 2017 that she was allegedly one nose job away from completely losing her nose. Experts say that the outer flare of her nostrils have been overly narrowed to a point of near disappearance. Another doctor even claimed that every surgery that LaToya gets in the future carries the risk of her face collapsing due to all the damage from past procedures. Her skin tone is also much lighter than before, and it's rumored that she has bleached her skin. At number 2, Mickey Rourke. For a long time, people have made some pretty harsh comments about Mickey Rourke's face. In his early career, he was praised for having a baby face and boyish charm, but now, not so much. A lot of people believe that he doesn't look anything like he used to, and a lot of that has to do with his botched plastic surgery. Mickey has spoken out about his altered appearance, saying that boxing is really what caused things to go downhill for him. Because he went in for reconstructive surgery from things that have been damaged through boxing, his face has never been the same. Speaking further on this, Mickey said, quote, most of it was to mend the mess of my face because of boxing, but I went to the wrong guy to put my face back together. I had my nose broken twice, I had five operations on my nose, and one on a smashed cheekbone." End quote. If Mickey had gone to someone else for these procedures, maybe things would have been different. And finally, number one, Cardi B. Cardi B started out as a reality TV star and turned into a Grammy winning rapper. Since she's been in the spotlight for so long, it's clear she's gone under the knife to change how she looks. She's not hiding it either. Cardi often talks about her surgeries. She was even forced to put some of her concerts on hold to recover from plastic surgery. She had complications from liposuction and was still in the process of recovering from breast implants, so her feet started to swell uncontrollably, making her unable to perform. When critics called her lazy for getting the lipo, she said she doesn't have time to work out. Cardi has also gotten implants in her butt to give her an hourglass figure, and it's speculated that she's gotten some Botox and filler as well. At number 10, Farrah Abraham. Teen Mom star Farrah Abraham has been pretty open about her cosmetic procedures and has been under the knife a number of times, but it just takes that one horrible moment to make you rethink all of your plastic surgery choices. You might have seen the infamous photo of Farrah Abraham's botched lip procedure, where she looks nothing like herself. But let me tell you how she got in that mess in the first place. In 2015, the reality star opened up in an interview where she spoke out about how she had a negative experience when she went under the knife for an experimental lip implant procedure. Farrah said that when she got the procedure done, she knew right away that something wasn't right when the anesthesia wasn't working for her. She didn't think too much of it at the time, but as it would turn out, she should have said something to the doctor sooner. After the procedure was done and the implant was put in, that's when things went from bad to worse. Turns out, Farrah had 
had a really intense reaction to something during the procedure that caused her lip to swell up like crazy, leading to those crazy photos. Luckily, she was able to get things sorted out and her lip went back to normal, but she did say that it was a really scary experience for her and she thought that she would never look like herself again. In at number 9, Jessica Simpson. Throughout her career, Jessica Simpson has changed a lot, at some points looking unrecognizable from her former self. Many credited the change in her appearance to simple weight gain, while others speculated she got cosmetic work done. Well, she just exposed the truth on Instagram, revealing that she was suffering with alcoholism that caused a dramatic change in her appearance. In the long caption, she describes how she looked unrecognizable during her battle with alcoholism. In the photo, her face looks incredibly puffy and inflamed. She explained the photo was from 2017, at the height of her addiction. She said in part, quote, This person in the early morning of November 1st is an unrecognizable version of myself. I had so much self-discovery to unlock and explore. Jessica also admitted in her 2020 memoir called Open Book that she had two tummy tucks in 2015 to get rid of loose skin from back-to-back -back pregnancies. She got an infection after the second procedure and was in the hospital for nine days to recover. At number eight, Amanda Lepore. American model and socialite Amanda Lepore is one person who isn't shy at all about the plastic surgery procedures that she has had and how much she's changed with each surgery. The transgender model, performer, and now author, who made a name for herself in Hollywood by just being herself, altered a lot of her body over the years, and she's even claimed to have the most expensive body on earth due to all of her surgeries. She's written and talked about all of the procedures that she's had done, and because it is such a long list, you can see how her looks have evolved so much over the years. She's had a nose job, her hairline lowered, her eyebrows lifted, double eyelid surgery, cheekbone, lip and breast augmentation, gender confirmation surgery, hormones, and she even had her ribs broken and reshaped to alter the size of her waist. She even got botched ones when she got silicone lip injections because she got too much filler and her lips got way too big for her liking and she looked so different. Different. Because she said that she got them done about 20 times and went a little overboard, she had to get them reduced because they just got way too big. She's happy with the way that she looks and she likes to evolve her appearance, so I love that for her. I really do. In at number 7, Christina Aguilera. In 2018, Christina stepped out with an entirely new appearance, which got fans talking. Her face looked very puffy and swollen, possibly from getting too much filler. Surgeons and fans had tons of reactions to her new look. One plastic surgeon said, quote, Christina may have the appearance of fuller cheeks due to increased volume from fillers such as Voluma or Restylane. Another said, I believe that Christina's puffiness can be attributed to overfilled facial fillers like belly fill or Voluma. She probably tried to fill out any wrinkles and give her face some youthful fullness. Her lips are also fuller, most likely from lip fillers. In 2015, it was also reported that Christina got a nose job. One surgeon said that he believes her doctor used cartilage to rebuild her nose after her first nose job was botched. At number 6, Justin Judlica. Justin Judlica, also known as the real life Ken doll, got famous because he was on the show Botched and became a fan favorite, so obviously I had to include him in this list. Justin became famous because of his exaggerated looks, because he made it his life's mission to become a real life Ken doll. For him, the more plastic he looks, the better. Obviously, Obviously, Justin wasn't born looking the way he does now, and if you look at old pictures of him, you can really see how drastically different he looks. Justin was on the show Botched very early on in the show's first season, making his debut in the series' first episode. He said that he's received about a thousand surgeries to achieve the look that he has now, and there's no sign of stopping his transformation anytime soon. Justin said that he became obsessed with his appearance after growing up watching the show Lifestyles of the Rich and Famous, and recalling that everyone on that show had plastic surgery. To him, he believed that this lifestyle meant that you were successful, and so he's made it his mission to look like an unrecognized recognizable plastic doll. Halfway at number 5, Michael Jackson. Michael Jackson first gained fame through the Jackson 5 as a child, and as he grew up, he started to look unrecognizable from his child self. At some point, his appearance changed so much, it was clear that he was undergoing plastic surgery. Much of it was deemed botched by the general public. It's rumored that he underwent countless nose jobs, as well as skin bleaching. However, Jackson claimed to have vitiligo, and that's why his skin lightened over time. When asked about his nose job, Jackson told Martin Bashir, quote, I've had no plastic surgery on my face, just my nose. It helps me breathe better so I can hit higher notes. I've had two nose jobs as I can remember. However, many plastic surgeons speculate he had far more than two nose jobs and that he developed nasal cripples due to the lack of tissue to breathe through. At number four, Jamie Lee Curtis. 
You wouldn't really guess it, but at one point, Jamie Lee Curtis got plastic surgery and she ended up looking a little unrecognizable. The actress opened up about a procedure she had received before shooting a movie where she got the fat taken out from underneath her eyes because she said that she was looking a little puffy. Well, it turns out that she got a little botched and her looks weren't too great because when she got to set to start filming a movie, the cameraman actually said that he couldn't shoot her anymore because her face looked so different. Jamie recalled feeling super embarrassed because she had just changed her looks too much. She also said that she was unaware of the fact that when you take fat from one area of your body, it quote, comes back in another place. Jamie took this botched experience as a learning moment and never tried a procedure like that again. And at number 3, Ariel Winter. Ariel gained notoriety as a teen star acting on Modern Family. Since leaving the show, her look has gotten incredibly mature and many think this isn't solely from genetics. On one Instagram post, fans were calling out Ariel for changing, saying that they liked how she looked before plastic surgery. Ariel was so offended by the comment that she actually responded to it, saying, quote, I appreciate you wanting to help girls love themselves the way they are, but you're also kind of cutting someone, me, down, which isn't what I think you were trying to do. I also didn't get plastic surgery. That's also not being supportive of women if you're just assuming something about the way they look. She's been open about getting a breast reduction in 2015, but many think she is lying and had more procedures. It's also been speculated she receives lip filler along with getting a small nose job. At number two, Barry Manilow. Some celebrities aren't shy about the work they've had done, and others go to great lengths to hide it. One celebrity who has continuously denied their plastic surgery is singer Barry Manilow, because even though there's been a lot of proof to indicate he's had work done, and the fact that he looks unrecognizable after all of those procedures, he still claims to be all natural. In an interview, Barry claimed to have only undergone surgeries and treatments for his health, like getting hip surgery and receiving steroid shots, but judging by the way that he looks nowadays, a lot of people aren't buying that and have pretty much revealed that he's been lying about getting work done for cosmetic purposes. It's been reported that over the years, Barry has undergone several procedures, including having had three facelifts and eyelid surgery. There are even photos of Barry from 2003 showing him leaving the plastic surgeon's office in Beverly Hills. In the photos, he's seen wrapped up in bandages while wearing a disguise of sunglasses and a blonde wig in order to avoid being recognized. But we all know that it's him. He's not fooling anyone. And finally, at number one, Celine Dion. In 2018, following the passing of her longtime husband, sources say that Celine tried to improve her look with cosmetic procedures, but the procedures were botched and she looked nothing like herself. The source said, quote, she totally lost her looks and is unrecognizable. The word is she went under the knife to try and give herself a fresh start, but whatever she's done, it clearly hasn't turned out very well. One plastic surgeon who did not treat Celine, Dr. Dave David, noted the changes are so drastic he wouldn't recognize her if he saw her out. Quote, she looks terrible, haggard, and homely. The doctor believed she had a nose job, fillers in her cheeks and under the eyes, Botox in her upper lip, and had her eyebrows thinned and lightened. And it's not a stretch to assume Celine had some procedures done as she revealed in the past that she is open to receiving facial filler.